Hey guys, how's it going? It's me, Random Guy TX from Co op Studios here, and uh, please watch this video in HD. And uh, this is for all the broken car parts in Area 3 of Hawaii for the Jaguar Type D. Or D Type. Alright, and this one is just going to be right off the road, right here to the right. And look, someone has already found it. Uh, there's a lot of people that were looking for these at the same time I was. Alright, and it's on the right side of the island. All these are going to be on the right side of the island. And this one is uh, right below this cool little uh, intersection here that's island that's in the water. And it's right below it on this like little blob shaped road or whatever you want to call it. And it's right after that first bend there. Right where my car is. Alright, and this next one, as you're flying down the dirt road here, uh, you drive past these uh, guardrails and uh, keep going until it ends and then go behind them. The uh, car will be right on top of this little hill. I'm doing this in uh, third person view so you guys can see the environment better. I normally drive in first person. And uh, it's right in the right below where we just were in this valley here. You can tell by these uh, dark mountains where it's at. Right off the main road here. It's just a nice straight dirt road. It's after that first turn, the zigzag road right where the second turn is alright now this next one is right when you uh, before that turn off the road just go off the road and just floor it all the way to the beach and be right there be careful not to go too fast because if you go in the water you'll, you will get me set And uh, this one, this one's pretty easy to identify where it is. It's right below where we just were. And uh, it's going to be on the coastline, so. And as as it would turn, it turns into the single road all the way down here. This is a clubhouse down here. And go down the single road, which has this little bay right here. But don't go all the way. And, you know, it's right where that first turn is, right where it starts straightening out. Just keep going straight. Don't take that turn. Just go straight all the way to the beach. It'll be right there. Right, this one, as you're going up the uh, roads here, and it starts flashing, wait till you get around the bend. When you do that, go left. I recommend, you know, getting a Hummer or something like this. And, uh, it'll be right up here on this little ledge. Careful not to fall off. Alright. This one, they're all, they're all pretty much in the same area. The beginning ones are all in the same area, so you won't be driving that far. And this is, you know, off the main road, and it just leads all the way up to the mountains. It is after, you know, the first turn, I mean the third turn, right when it starts straightening out again. Alright, now this one, you keep going. This one is another one that's behind the guardrails. As you keep going past these guardrails, wait till there's an opening. Go off the road, and it'll be right up here on this hill. Depending on which way you're going, you know, it'll be different. And it's by this uh, clothes shop here on the right side as well. If you would keep going, it's, you know, by that, uh, by that little lake or whatever right there if you would keep going. Alright, with, with this one, when you're going you're going around this bend, you see like these uh, little tojos looking things. Take a left right, you know, before the guardrail. And just keep following the guardrail. I'll be right here on the side of the hill. Oh look, there's another person. It's a little ways behind it. Alright, and... Alright, as you're, uh, it's, it's a little breakaway road that comes off the main highway. As you're coming down here, come down this turn, it's, you know, before that house, and it's down here at the bottom of that little boot-shaped looking road. And this one is... Right when you're going, right when it starts flashing, you take a right, and just drive under the bridge 
right in between those off on and off ramps and it's right underneath the bridge I hate it when you press A and it tries to challenge somebody all right this one's a little bit further south and it's right by that main highway as you can see and uh, it's in between you know those two on ramps on each side the circle one and that whatever the fuck that thing looks like one but, and then this one as you know that's a dead end there's a dirt road that goes left take a left on that dirt road and as you're going up here on this mountain there's like a little radar dish it's like I don't know like some CIA outpost or something and uh, there's some there's some other people looking for these as well I, I, I play TU1 a lot, so I know a lot of these places. You know, it's, it's right, you know, after that house. It's right along there. It's very easy to find. It's on this separate little island here. That's sticking out like a sore thumb. See, there's a little dirt road that leads up to it. Alright, this one, when it starts flashing, it will be on the right side of the, uh, not on the beach, but on the other side where the buildings are in this little courtyard. And see, it's by that little lake. But it's that, uh, it's right in that little lake, that little turn right there. Once it starts flashing a lot, just look to your right. Alright, this one just start following the uh, white wall here, the short one, and wait till it ends. Drive in between the rock, go past this, take a right past the playground, try not to run over any kids, and it's right here behind the bushes. I will have an annotation in the video of the gameplay of this car, and uh, yeah, and I will have part four up pretty soon here, probably within the same night. And, uh, it's right here on the coastline. It's right before that big turn. It's very easy to find. So if you guys have any questions, comments, or suggestions, please post them. And uh, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more.